The investigations into the damning allegations of corruption against Crime Chief Lyndon Alves, who is presently on administrative leave, has concluded, and according to Police Commissioner Leslie James, he is cleared of criminal misconduct. What I can say to you that the investigation has been completed and I've obtained a file, and um, in terms of criminal conduct, Mr. Alves has been cleared. So can you say what's going to happen now? Well, internally, administratively, there's some other issues we deal with, and that, that is the final position. Anyway. So but we... criminal conduct, he has been cleared of any criminal conduct. However, when asked whether Alves will return to his post as crime chief, this is what Commissioner James told reporters. I didn't say that. Did I say that? I said there's some other administrative issues we're dealing with, and that's going to be dealt with shortly. In June, the crime chief was sent on administrative leave to facilitate a probe into corruption allegations leveled against him. Given that the Office of Professional Responsibility, OPR, was conducting the investigation, meaning the police was investigating itself, which in itself raised a number of questions. Prior to his suspension of duties, Rangsin Burbese blew the whistle on alleged corruption by the crime chief and claimed that he was shielding a few junior rogue ranks who have been linked to criminals. Among the allegations against Alves was his alleged use of his influence during his tenure as commander of B Division Berbice to protect rogue cops. Reporting for the Evening News, I am Kristen Macklingham.